here we are in the Fleetwood. We do. Yeah, and they have this nice uh, desk thing here that I do like. See here, I won't. Well, I'm not going to turn the seat around because they have it set this way so you can see. Well, you can, but I didn't want to mess with it. Uh, basically, they did this so that you can have a full area as you have plenty of people and more seating room so that you can interact with the rest of the coach. They have the three drink holders here. They have some cabinets up here, as well as a couple screens. I didn't know why, so it'll... A little tricky. Uh, Compartment. Okay, and then over here we have our normal air conditioning controls. We have our other monitors, backup monitors, our normal smiley screen, our various generator, radio, on night -like start buttons. We have our automatic levelers. That looks like you have a uh, wireless charging dock in there for the phone right now. Oh wow, that's interesting. Yes, it does right here. I won't put my phone in there because if you see my other video, I did end up leaving my phone on a wireless dock. Yeah. Two USB chargers here, mm -hmm. the leveling system over here, and then a rear dash camera here. Yeah. Here's the storage area up there, mm -hmm. on this side. The TV's for the bunk bed up here, and over here is the other one. So, and then we have a little storage area. This is be for the bunk bed. When they're up there, they can put their reading material and such up there. Right behind there, we have the dinette set. Oh, we have the dinette wall. Well, the bunk bed. Bunk bed here holds 500 pounds. Mm-hmm. Oh, look, we got a couple cabinets here. This must be the pantry, an interesting spot, but this appears to be the pantry. Right behind the uh, driver's seat. Okay. We have our dinette set, a couple drink holders. There is some storage space underneath. These actually pop up and you can do that. Okay, we have two cabinets here that are passed through above the dinette set. Okay. And going down into the living room area, there's the theater seating. And there are three cabinets, or no, just two cabinets that are passed through and then another two cabinets that are passed through. So a total of six but two at a time. We do have theater seating with the electronic controls, a nice good size end table with plenty of storage underneath. No, even a free soda. Yeah, that's a gentleman's. And going to the other side, we have our kitchen area. We have plenty of space, look at that, wow, for, nice yeah, space. plenty of space for your dishes. We have all little counter over the door. Uh huh. We have one over the microwave as well. This is a convection microwave. You have a nice window to look outside when you're cooking and doing things. And that's a place to store spices up here. Yeah. Over here is a gas stove. A three burner gas propane stove. Uh-huh. We have farm style kitchen sink, double. Okay, plenty of storage spaces underneath the sink. And this is just a little sponge holder up there. Yeah. You got three drawers here. I'll just do the top two there. The middle one's the same as the top. Below the range, you also have two drawers. One there, one there. And then you have a nice residential style microwave. This is a microwave? It is. <laughs> it's a new style. It cools your food as well as heats it. It's <laughs> cold instead of warm. Okay, folks, refrigerator, refrigerator, refrigerator. You know it's going to be a long day when she starts this early. <laughs> okay, okay, this must be a slide-up shelf. There you go. Oh, well, that's pretty deep. Look how deep that is. That's why it would be hard for me to reach in there. Okay, then you have your fireplace on the bottom with your TV above it. And two cabinets there. Or one cabinet with two doors. It's just a texture on the fireplace, it's like real brick. Yeah, they actually made it uh, texture like that. I don't like that because I think these catch dust. I'd rather have a flat surface, but that's personal. Half bath there. Half bath with a cabinet up top. Plenty of leg room here. Yeah, the business position is really good. Little cubby here for your magazines. L little drawer here. And a little bit of space there. Yeah, and a giant. good size. size. Relatively medicine cabinet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep, that's the half bath. Let's go on back and see what we got back here. Okay. This is the king size bed. The cabinets are separated 
Um, we got one small one in the middle, two larger ones on either end. Yeah, okay. Got a plug, so I just take all the things. When this is closed, you have a gap with your CPAP up there. Mm -hmm. Different design. Mm -hmm. yeah, you do have that. outlets on either end. Yeah. And those have the plugs. And nice little style. End table on either side. Mm -hmm. Looks like a king. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, symmetrical cabinets. We'll do just one side here. We do have the wardrobe here. One, there, yeah. one just like it on the other side. Right below it, you have two little slide out drawers. The other one is space you can't use, so you can only use one side. Mm -hmm. Then you have your television. And there it goes. Actually, it comes with a free roller, uh, blind roller. Okay, and then right below that you have six drawers, all the same size. And then, of course, as I mentioned, you got the same symmetrical. Well, maybe not, because this actually has a different cabinet. Huh. So it's a washer dryer, perhaps. Yeah, but that's not big enough. Well, I have the panel there. I imagine it's a washer dryer, a single washer. Yeah, maybe a combined washer dryer space. Because it has the louvers. Yes. Okay, going into the bathroom, let's take a look at the bathtub. Bathtub? Shower. I want lunch, I want lunch. Oh, I'm drowning in the bathtub. Okay, up here right now, we're just a little bit shy of space. I doubt it quit, but once again, this annoying bar in front of me. Look at this. I'm trying to wash my teeth here. Seriously, this is adjustable. It would go up to the top. So, and it's a maximum position here. It's kind of stuck there, but yes, I can wash my face here. You see, it's self. So, I have to go like this to wash my hair. It's so inconvenient. But such is the life of a tall person in a small world. So, what else we got here? Well, we got a cabinet over here for your towels and whatnot. And then we got four nice drawers here, all the same size. Uh, four of those, that's a lot of nice storage sure there. And over here we have our medicine cabinet. Nice extra space here. Got room on the toilet here. And below here we just have a little bit of space. Pretty far just behind there. Yeah, well this is a panel here, so it only goes back a little ways. Amazing. Well, how's the business position? They actually have a towel bar. Yes, I like that. Well, I just want you to remember to always open the doors to adventure. And start all your journeys with... The RBGs. Y'all have a great day. Bye.